Hello guys. Have you ever tried to remove the head on these? And it's just a pain in the ass. It seems like it's really sealed and it's pretty tight, all right? So I don't have pliers. I don't have any large tools to remove this. Well, I actually do, but I don't want to go and find them like somewhere in my garage. Uh, so what you're gonna need is microfiber towel. This thing is really, really hard. Um, when you twist it, it just doesn't want to open. It kind of reminds me of the medicine bottles that are uh, childproof. And now that I think about it, maybe that's why they did it. It's childproof. Um, I don't know, but this is extremely hard. So what you're gonna, you're gonna need is a microfiber towel. So you're gonna grasp it like this and the reason you need the towel is because this plastic is very hard it can potentially cut your fingers squeeze really tight keep spinning and voila got it open i didn't break anything in here so we're good and the reason that i wanted to open this is because i'm gonna dump the rest of this glass cleaner here uh i mean this is just something that i use around um my own vehicles um and it's they're both ammonia free so i'm not mixing any any other um chemicals in here so let me go ahead and dump this and of course right so apparently chemical guys, when they originally put this, the spray head here, they didn't remove all the plastic. Okay. So I just dropped a little bit of glass cleaner here. No biggie. And I want, I want to get rid of this bottle. It's just taking space in my garage. I lost the sprayer or it probably broke. I don't know what happened. So I just want to get rid of it. Um, trying to clean up my my space here and bring in some new products, some new bottles. This one got to go. So there you have it. Uh, well, I'm going to go ahead and twist it back in here to show you guys that it's actually not broken. Bam. Let's give it a test. Perfect.